The desire for a lovely home and the largest house in the world is widespread among individuals, which is why dream home is one of the most popular expressions. However, it has also become a status symbol in materialistic culture of today, especially among high society. Beachside houses, which are from the drudgery of city life and provide a breathtaking perspective at any time of day are truly a haven for couples. If you want a beautiful backdrop for your photographs with a brilliant blue sky, sparkling water, fine sand, and luxury luxury refuge. This video is for you. So in this video, we will take a look at the some of the most amazing beach houses in the world. But before we continue, do not forget to hit that like button. Also subscribe to Unimaginable and turn on notifications so that you can always know whenever we upload a new video. Celebrities and the wealthiest people in the world may afford some of the most stunning residences by the water that you could imagine. They are unquestionably huge properties, but they also exhibit their own distinct architecture and design. So here is the list of the top 11 amazing beach houses in the world. Number 11. Tip of the Tail Villa Tip of the Tail, a tiny stretch of waterfront property on Turtle Tail Drive, is where you know you can take it easy, and that when you see this little slice of ocean real estate called Tip of the Tail, you shall come to a complete halt. Another house on the water in Turks and Caicos, but it definitely has some Myconian influences with just a touch of Turks architecture and color. This stunning property consists of 11,000 square feet and six bedrooms, but more significantly, the fortunate buyer will have the last section of this secluded peninsula to themselves, making it ideal for individuals who dislike sharing. For a modest investment of $7 million, you may have all of this white sandy beach and blue waters to yourself. As you stare out into the Caicos Islands from your private white sandy beach, with just the fish and lobsters in the sea for neighbors, you may catch 100 fish if you choose. The tip of the tail villa is zen to the extreme, and it is truly ideal for when you need a vacation from work. This may be the greatest workplace on earth for anyone who works remotely. Number 10. Floating Seahorse It is also a stunning example of how Dubai continues to amaze. It is a bit more modest than the Burj Khalifa, but it still has the highest infinity swimming pool in the world and plenty of amenities. While it is not exactly beachfront property, the floating seahorse is right on the water. The man-made islands designed to resemble a map of the world are home to this floating dwelling. The Clydenst Group came up with these sea view homes on the water. After after more than 5,500 hours of study and 13,000 hours of design and engineering work to ensure they were just right. Because what good is a home on the water if it sinks? In 2016, the designs for these floating seahorses were released, and there was considerable excitement about them. How much are each of these seahorse sea mansions going for? You are looking at around $12 million for the entire property, but there are so many of them that they are more like icebergs. The master bedroom and bathroom, which measure 270 square feet across, are located underwater. To add a few more layers to the story, the sublevel has floor-to-ceiling windows where you may look out over your own private 500-square-foot coral garden. Number 9. One Palm Dubai Most of the most expensive real estate in the world is found in Dubai, where the emirate is home to the Burj Khalifa and other man-made continent islands. It should therefore follow that the majority of the costliest real estate in the world is located there. In 2017, One Palm in Dubai sold a penthouse on its top floor for $27.5 million, making it immediately the prettiest penthouse of the city. Of course, the penthouse was acquired by a member of the city council. It included a 12 seat state-of-the-art indoor movie theater, a business lounge with a private meeting room, their own private jetty, a gym, sauna, spa, several swimming pools, and even a library and hair salon to run up such an expensive price tag. The penthouse is a five-bedroom home with floor-to-ceiling windows in the main living area. It also has a private rooftop deck, allowing anyone fortunate enough to be inside at night to enjoy the finest perspective of the city. Number 8 to 23 Star Island Drive The $49 million Mosaic Estate 23 Star Island Drive is the most expensive home in Miami-Dade County, according to Trulia. It has a complete view of Biscayne Bay and covers almost two acres of land. The lot is enormous, measuring 80,000 square feet, with a 327-foot waterfront and its own docking facility. This is another residence that allows you to bring your yacht or boats right up to the property after a brief joy ride. A billiards room, a corridor full of enormous walk-in closets, marble kitchen countertops and floors, and a beautiful spiral staircase are all part of this home. You may relax in the pool or play tennis on the full-size court when you want some fresh air outside. 
23 Star Island Drive is located in one of the most desirable luxury communities on Star Island of Miami Beach. This artificial island in Biscayne Bay is only accessible via its bridge. Number 7. Little Pipe K. The Bahamas is a popular vacation destination for thousands of people every year because of the food, scenery, people, and of course, the weather. But there is one place in particular that steals the show. Do not let the name deceive you, despite its diminutive size. Little Pipe Key on Grand Bahama Island is anything but little. That is probably why ownership of such a slice of paradise costs hundreds of millions of dollars today. So what exactly are you expecting to receive at Little Pipe K? You undoubtedly undoubtedly get those breathtaking views of the ocean, but it is not limited to one side. Because Little Pipe K is a private island, you are getting the complete 360-degree view of the landscape here. Say goodbye to noisy neighbors and the racketing sounds of automobiles roaring and honking down the street. This is all yours, but the best news is that the island already has all of the facilities required to make it extremely easy to live in. As soon as you sign those paperwork, you may start using it all up. You shall have 40 acres of land entirely to yourself and a 5,300 square foot fully furnished mansion to call your own. The Tiny Pipe K is a private playground that will make you feel as if you have died and gone to heaven. This beachfront property lies nicely within the Exuas Archipelago, so it is not far from Miami if you want to enjoy the sun among beautiful people on the beach in the city. The only significant drawback of living on Tiny Pipe K is the cost of maintenance, so you shall also have to pay about $1.5 million every year to keep it running. However, it may be well worth the additional expenditure. Number 6. Padaro Lane You cannot talk about gorgeous waterfront residences without going to the lovely coast of California. The Padaro Lane home is magnificent in its own right, providing 2,500 square feet of living area and sitting perfectly in Santa Barbara, the Carpinteria town of the county, one of the costliest counties in the state. But it is impossible to overlook the view, which at the end of the day is what you are paying for here. The Padaro Lane house provides a front and central look at the beach. Because the land measures more than 4.2 acres, much of the beach is essentially private to the owners, which is a great deal. So not only does this beachfront property provide you with some well-earned peace and quiet, but it is also an excellent investment. There is a horse stable, and while the home on Padaro Lane does not include any horses, the spacious barn can comfortably hold nine of them. So how much does this seaside estate on Padaro Lane cost? Prepare to pay around $100 million for it, but you shall be too hot to gallop in such a fantastic setting. Number 5. The Sanctuary at Loon Point Sanctuary is a secure haven in the lovely Santa Barbara County, California, where we have the simply named Sanctuary at Loon Point. This magnificent chateau may be yours for $160 million if you are prepared to pay that much. You cannot discuss the sanctuary without mentioning the view. This vast tract of land lies at the foot of a cliff overlooking the Pacific Ocean. Since this private property ensures that you do not have to share that vista with anybody else, it is definitely a benefit. The entire sanctuary at Loon Point Estate is approximately 22 acres in size, which may be difficult to navigate. However, the property includes five separate land parcels that are linked by a private and gated road, giving people who live there the feeling of being royalty in California. The Loon Point Sanctuary was designed by Uber billionaire hedge fund owner Bruce Kopner and includes not one but two residences, each with about 8,000 square feet of space. They each have 10 bedrooms and 21 bathrooms in addition to a spa cabana and two swimming pools. You may view the panorama from either of the two pools if you do not want to walk down to the beach. There is even your own citrus orchard on the premises. This location is incredible, and there is still plenty of land left over despite the two mansions here that anyone may easily construct a few more houses if they so choose. Number 4. The Gemini Mansion in Florida The Gemini Mansion, formerly the most expensive home in the United States at $165 million, feels like a resort rather than a single person house. That is probably because it covers 16 acres and stretches from land to sea. It is an amazing mansion located outside of Palm Beach, Florida, with 12 bedrooms in the main house and another seven in the guest cottage. There are 34 bathrooms throughout the mansion. That is one bathroom per day of the month, plus some. 
The Gemini home has been standing since the 1940s and was previously occupied by fashion icon and socialite Gloria Guinness. Now, however, it is owned by the 14th wealthiest family in the United States. Living here is as close as you can get to owning a piece of paradise if you have enough money, if you have got it. 1,200 feet of frontage on the Atlantic Ocean and another 1,300 feet on the intercoastal waterway provide living here a slice of paradise. Number 3. The Milestone at Meadow Lane when the uber-rich of the east coast of the United States want to get away from it all, they flock to their second home in the Hamptons. Only the wealthiest of them will live on the beachfront, and only one of them will have ownership over Milestone at Meadow Lane. The Milestone at Meadow Lane is a mansion with 15,000 square feet of opulent space. While the entire estate provides the owner eight well-manicured acres of lush lawn, enter inside and you shall get lost in one of the 11 bedrooms, 12 full bathrooms, or four half bathrooms. There is even a caretaker cottage for when friends come to visit. But aside from that, it is the view that will truly blow your mind. The Milestone at Meadow Lane extends for over 500 feet along the Atlantic Ocean, from Shinnecock Bay to the Atlantic. It is really breathtaking, and if you stand at the edge of the property, you shall feel like a Kennedy looking out over the enormous, limitless ocean. The landmark at Meadow Lane comes with a separate pool and hot tub, as well as a five-car garage and deep-water bayside dock in true mansion style. The whole area costs $175 million. Number 2. 4. Fairfield Pond Ira Leon Rennert is the founder and CEO of Renko Group, a worldwide conglomerate. He owns 4 Fairfield Pond, an Italian Renaissance-style house in the Hamptons, which is certainly one of the wealthiest and most opulent communities in the United States. The Hamptons are without a doubt one of the wealthiest and most extravagant areas in America, but 4 Fairfield Pond absolutely puts its neighbors to shame. The extravagant estate of Rennert had 63 acres of beachfront property to himself, and he may use it as he sees fit. However, the residence itself is a whopping 62,000 square feet with 29 bedrooms, so Rennert will be sleeping in a new room almost every night for a month, with 39 bathrooms and a 91-foot dining room. This mansion does not skimp on luxuries. This many-story structure, which was built in the year 2003, truly resembles a banquet hall rather than anything else. There is also a a bowling alley, squash courts, tennis courts, three swimming pools, a basketball court, and finally, the icing on the cake, a garage that can accommodate up to 100 automobiles. For the price of $248 million, you could have it all. Number 1. Odeon Tower Penthouse the Odeon Tower is a pair of skyscrapers in Monaco that is undoubtedly home to some of the wealthiest people in the world. This penthouse is located on top of second tallest building of Europe. It is on the European Mediterranean coastline and is by no means your average penthouse. That is not because it has 35,000 square feet, but rather because it is five stories tall, making it one of the most costly homes per square foot when it was put on the market in 2014. Also known as the Sky Penthouse, the Odeon Tower Penthouse offers a panoramic view of the Mediterranean Sea and hopefully does not scare off prospective buyers due to its proximity to an infinity pool and water slide that will take you down to the balcony below. It is absolutely nuts and an amount of $330 million buys you everything. Well, that is the end of the video. Which one of these beach houses was the most fascinating? Tell us in the comments below. We hope you have found this video interesting. If so, then do smash that like button. And if this is the kind of content that you like to see, hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell. See you next time.